I'm Erin Fury, Associate Crafts Editor at Martha Stewart. What better way to celebrate spring in your home than with trays decoupaged with the first blooms of the season? You will need a white tray, a printed image, a craft knife and cutting mat, gloss finish decoupage medium, and a brush. There are so many beautiful first spring flowers to choose from. I printed out one of my favorites, a helleborus. With a craft knife, just start by detail cutting around all the little leaves and shapes. You can page through old magazines or books or search MarthaStewart.com for a gallery of first spring flowers. You could use a detail scissor to cut out some of these little leaf shapes as well. An image like this one works especially well because of its white background. That way, if you accidentally leave a little bit of space, it won't show up on the white tray. So keep cutting around the petals of your helleborus until the entire bloom is cut. Gorgeous. And now I just need to decoupage it on. With delicate cutouts like these, it's much easier to paint the surface of the tray first instead of painting the actual cutout. Make sure that your tray is clean and dry and begin to apply the medium in nice thin strokes. If you do see any large dust motes at this time, you can quick grab them before they completely dry into the surface of the tray. Lay the cutouts where you'd like them, then going around with a bit more decoupage medium, make sure each petal and each leaf is stuck down. At this point, you can start brushing over the leaves and petals too. Keep these coats thin. It's okay if some bits are popping up at this point. You can always go back in and fix a little leaf. On larger surface areas like this entire bloom, just make sure that there's no wrinkles. So once all the leaves and petals are stuck down and you have a, a thin coat over everything, let this dry for one to two hours and then we'll go back in for another coat. I added a second coat and let it dry, which makes this both durable and washable. And now I can enjoy these first spring blooms all year.